All right, y'all, so today I'm gonna be trying to recreate this famous movie dish from Disney's Ratatouille. My whole thing with it is he tried that dish and he literally almost crapped himself, honestly. I mean, it took him back to his childhood. And there's no way he thought it was that good. Maybe I should try to make it myself. Let's go see what it's talking about. All right, so first we had to start by preheating the oven to 375. Then we went ahead with our pot and got some boiling water and let that boil. Then with our potatoes. Peace, bye. I don't want to go ahead with your potatoes. Dump them in the water. God damn it. Make sure they're not like on top of each other because then they're not going to all cook evenly. We can get a little bit more potatoes in there too. Just because we love potatoes. They look like lemons kind of. Right? Yeah. Are you saying yeah because you love me? You won't. Dude. What? Stop your nonsense. Let those boil for about three to four minutes and we're gonna remove them from the water and we're gonna take them right out. Stop and feeling flies, baby. Grown ups when she opened the car hood. Trying to hold back this feeling for so long. Hey, let me get a quick shout out to uh Country Boy Jack. There's YouTube, Big Dragon, something, 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 and um, Sir, Sir something. I forget what um, his name is, but y'all, I've been seeing y'all a lot of my comments, so I just want to appreciate y'all for real. Trying to hold back this feeling. So basically what I'm doing right now is just draining the potatoes. Where's your strainer? I don't have a strainer, so I got to strainer myself. How, how do you have a, how do you just chef? I'm not in my kitchen right now, my home kitchen. Like, you know how you get your home Xbox? Mm -hmm. Not in my home kitchen. Unless somebody else's Xbox. Okay. All right, while you wait for those potatoes to cook down right over there on the table, you want to go ahead and slice up the rest of your veggies. <laughs> so first, we're going to go with our yellow squash. Peace, bye. Just like that. If you're doing this at home, kids, please do not cut your veggies like that. I do not want to be responsible for a missing finger. Then you want to go in with your. Then you want to go in with your cucumber. It's not a cucumber. What is this? Oh, zucchini, um, bro. <laughs> Tripping. A zucchini. Or get my knuckle. Cut up our bell peppers into slices, just like this. And don't get any ideas now. Come on, it's just a vegetable. Oh, I thought it was hollow, kinda. Very thin, guys. Not changing up Nathan. You don't. Care. All right, so now y'all want to get about a cup of milk and then put that in the microwave for about two minutes. Then to a medium saucepan, y'all want to go in with equal parts butter and flour. And mix it all together until the flavor of the flour goes away. Then once it's nice and thick, you want to go ahead and add your milk gradually and stir that up nice and neat. I think I add too much. Because what is that supposed to be? Hmm? What is that supposed to be? It's supposed to be a thick sauce. It's supposed to coat the back of the spoon. Peace of Yes. Now you're gonna see I'm an actual chef. I'm not an actual chef. I'm a fraud. Fraud! Oh, I hate flour. I hate flour, bro. It's like unresistible. Baby drop them keys. Alright, now you wanna go in with that olive oil down there, smooth it on all over the bottom of the pan. Then you wanna get your tomato sauce and go ahead and smear that everywhere too. You know, a nice little layer on the bottom. Then after that, you want to spread around the garlic and then your thyme, you know, nice and neat. And then I went in with that. You know how to get a little spice. So I went in with that pepper flake, you know what I'm saying? Then you want to go ahead and add the bechamel sauce. Go ahead and stir that up nice and neat. Make it look all good. All right, y'all. It's now time for the funnest part of this dish. You want to go ahead and get your cut-up vegetables and layer them like so in the video. And you can add a little sauce on top. This ain't called for, but you know I like my shit look juicy, you know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, that's gonna be good right there, guys. Now we wanna let that sit in there for about 55 minutes and uh, just go do something with your life. All right, so while y'all waiting for the potatoes to get done cooking, why don't y'all go ahead and hit that like button, please? Please, this is the like button. Go ahead, sit right there, hit that like button, subscribe and comment. And uh, let me know what y'all favorite scene from Ratatouille is, all right? With that being said, I went ahead and scooped me up a pile of stuff and it didn't look right.
about to throw up. Dude, what type of ratatouille is that? <laughs> this video's over. But the video wasn't over just yet. You know what I'm saying? All I had to do was grab a couple of vegetables and assemble it, put it together, make it look all nice and neat, ready for your date tonight. You know what I'm saying? Peace, bye. All right. So we're gonna get our zucchini, our squash, the zucchini, and these potatoes don't look done. Okay. okay. Tastes like beetroot. <laughs> you say this tastes like beetroot? The nutmeg is heavy. You can taste the nutmeg, right? Yeah. It's definitely there. Very soupy. Very soupy, like sweet, subtle. I like that. Maybe because uh, the milk you used. Almond milk. Vanilla flavor, but. You know what I Would you make this again? I would make this in like a late fancy dinner night with my babe. I and wouldn't like, dare fucking make, make this. Girl? No. This, how this is tasting. I don't know if you, we have two different taste buds. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I actually go to taste. I need to go to a, a Thai restaurant and get ratatouille and get ratatouille and compare this because, I mean, by my understanding, this is the only. This is what I. This is what ratatouille is supposed to taste like. Go ahead, dude. It's nice that. and steamy too. Yeah, I, I like the agriculture of it. Get you some sauce. Yeah. Taste this. Taste this. <laughs> Sweet, tomatoey, and uncooked vegetables. <laughs> now the vegetables cooked. Yeah, yeah, I'm brown. Just be a dickhead. I like the spice factor. Because if it was just straight sweet, it would have been. It's not. It's light. It's there. It's there. It's kicking it. But um, it's not bad. I wouldn't. I wouldn't buy do it, it again. No. <laughs> we didn't make it right, bro. That's the only thing. That's the only reason why. Yeah, I don't think. Yeah. Don't let us fool y'all, bro. Ratatouille might actually be a really good dish. But we just cannot um, manage to. It's not bad though. Thing. It's not bad. It's like, yeah. I'll give it like a six and a half. It could probably earn a seven. No, I guess six. Six? Six? Flat out six? Okay. That's not bad though. That's not bad. That's bad. That's not bad, y'all. <laughs> well, I hope y'all enjoyed the video, man. And go ahead, hit that like button and subscribe. Actually, no. You know what? Y'all don't even got to. Just go have a good day, all right? I'm a shalom.